best player for every Guilty Gear Strive character by a Potemkin scrub. Let's go. Starting off with Soul Bad Guy. And yes, I'm hiding the name tag so you guys don't cheat and figure out who it is ahead of time before I say it. Now, one could argue this could be multiple people, but on the other hand, you really can't argue Umi shows the best. Thank God they switched to Soul because if they kept playing Happy Chaos, oh jeez, I would be living in a nightmare. Next up, we got my secondary, my main boy that's not my main boy, Kai Kisk. I, I love this character, and I know he's a degenerate, but man, it feels so good to scum dipper kids. I'll tell you who can really cook with this character, and that's Danny. Danny Phantom, man, he just goes all in with this character. I don't think I've ever seen him lose, except, you know, a couple times when I watched him lose. But man, he's good. Now, onto a character I'm not really fond of, but I mean, I can appreciate, I guess, this person for playing them. Um, Naga. I don't like him, he does big damage, and he's not a grappler, so you're not allowed to have that. And there's another character in this list that also does that, which I'll get to. But you know who really is really great with this? Nubenheimer. Is no, hands down, I don't think any other Nago player comes close. But enough about Nago. Now let's talk about May. Now, I actually don't really know too many Mays besides one in particular, and it's Slash. Slash just dominates the May market, and uh, it shows. I think he was in top eight for Evo for last year and the year before, so you gotta give it to him. Now on to another character that I don't really like, Leo. I think there's two potential people for this spot, but one takes it because of uh, how good they do in tournament play. So honorable mention to MFCR, they go they go wild with Leo. Um, I'll never fight this person, but what I see, I don't think I will ever take a match off of. But the, the number one spot has to go to Tempest NYC. I mean, the man is just built like a beast. Next up, we got my character I first played with and stuck with for a little bit, Chip. I like this character a lot. They're fast. And despite me being like one of the slowest characters, this character seems really cool and hard to play. And you have to mash a lot of buttons. But the best player, Bean. There's no way that this player does not use a Game Shark in tournament. That's all I gotta say. We're just gonna bounce all around here. Let's dip into the DLC character. Um, let's start with Asuka. Now, I used to know that Gobu used to be wild with Asuka, but now I think Zondo's the, the, the big chef now. He's the head chef. He's, he's going wild with Asuka. Drop Ram, RIP. But I also think he also plays uh, Elfelt now, so I don't really know. So I'm just gonna say Zondo. Next on the list, we got Bridget. Now, I know this is completely out of order, but you know, we're just gonna deal with it. Um, the best Bridget player, I would say, is probably Angel Eye. Um, honestly, I haven't seen too much Bridget play besides Angel Eye. I know uh, Diophone and Super Noon, I think, used to play them, but Angel Eye is, uh, Angel Eye does really well with her, so Angel Eye it is. Too easy. Piece of cake. Moving on to Ramathal Valentine. This is my training partner's character. They played this character in LFL. So I know SQ used to play her. Uh, there's Anima and Red Ditto. Um, all really good players. But with my glue brain, I'm going to have to say I think it's SQ. Um, they're the person I see in tournaments the most or I guess get the highest ranks in tournaments. They might have switched characters, but I'm pretty sure they could still kill a lot of the top players with Ram. So, SQ it is. Moving on to the best asshole, Axel player. Now, I only say this because uh, it's a zoner, so, you know, they uh, they do bad things to grapplers, but, you know, this person's really not a asshole. And it's a little biased because they're on our team, is uh, Trevor Sue. <laughs> As I show him die from Red Ditto. But honestly, he really does some wonders with Axel. And I don't care what rating update says. I don't give a shit. Trevor Sue's the best. Let's go. Now on to my least favorite matchup against Pot. 
Gold Lewis. I don't like this character. I don't want to see him. I don't want to play him. I don't want anything to do with this character. In fact, whenever I play against Gold Lewis, I switch to Kai. So if you really want me to play my secondary, just play Gold Lewis against me, and uh, I will switch to Kai and be probably significantly worse. But anyways, uh, honorable mention to Red I Am Not. Their Gold Lewis is pretty damn good. I don't really watch too much Gold Lewis play, but you know, whenever I see Red I Am Not, I get scared. But the Gold Lewis I hate the most is Rang 13. Because uh, they disrespected uh, Abby Seraph when they were trying to get a W in top eight in Brazil. But you know, Rang just ruined it. But uh, I guess they, they're the best Gold Lewis, so it's fine. Anyways, moving on to the best Faust player. First, I just want to give honorable mention to Skullduggers. I feel like if Skullduggers went to more tournaments, he would really go far with uh, Faust. But the best player, I think, is probably Apology Man. I mean, he's he's up there with the GOATs. The best Eno player? Well, they got Eno in their name. So it's kind of easy. Daro Eno? Easily the best. No contestants, no nothing. Everyone's like 20 years behind him. I don't know how he does it, but he mixes the shit out of people. Puts people in the blender. <laughs> Moving on to a pseudo puppet character that is not Zotto One, Jacko. And honestly, the only Jacko I really know is Carrot. Um, I think rating update says another person, but uh, we're gonna go with Carrot. But speaking of puppet characters, let's talk about Zotto One. The one and only best player. Oh shoot, actually I think there's, there might be two. Uh, there's Jonathan Tenne, and then uh, the, the, the guy that yells whenever he fights May, uh, Latif. And I might have to hand it to Latif for this one. I'm sorry, sorry Jonathan. Please forgive me. Moving on. Oh God, I don't even know. I don't even know anyone that plays this character. Testament? Does anyone know who plays this character? All right, well, rating update says cute fox girl. So we're just gonna say cute fox girl um, is the best Testament player. Next up, we got Biking. Now, I have a little bit of bias since a jump dash player. <laughs> plays biking and uh pork laser shout out to pork but i was watching some some other videos of top tier biking and i gotta say this shine person is really good wait a second is this the same shine shine that plays pot oh my god it is why did you switch why you know what it's pork laser pork laser is the best one moving on to sin um, you know, I really haven't seen too many Sin players. I remember, I think Tempest taking Sin out against Umi Show, and that was pretty cool. But I don't think, I don't think it goes to Tempest again, does it? Uh, Sneed Chungus is pretty good, and he has a good name. So Sneed Chungus, you're the best Sin player. Congratulations. Anyways, uh, we got Bedman next. I don't really like Bedman anymore. I get wrecked by Bedman. Despite what uh, a boy's tier list says, I don't care. Bedman kicks my ass. And maybe it's a me issue. Um, but I don't really know anyone that plays Bedman. So uh, the Angus Cheeseburger, whoever's Angus, Angus, they're the best one. Let's go Angus. Man, guys, I really just don't know people. Jeez Louise. Anyways, we're moving on to Alpha. And, uh... Domi, uh, <laughs> Domi, <laughs> you know what, once again, the only person I know that plays Elf Elf, SQ. SQ, uh, you take the cake and you eat the cake. Congratulations. Moving on to one of the best girls in the game, Milia. Oh, shoot. That's going to get people, that's going to get people mad. You know what, she's, uh, yeah, she's good. Anyways, uh, the best kid person that plays Milia, Walter. I don't know how where this man came from. I don't know where he's from, but man, does Walter, Walter White knows how to cook.
Move on to the next character. The best Johnny. Johnny on the spot. We got Peppery Splash. Oh shoot, I should have made that a little bit more like who's it gonna be, but yeah, it's it's Peppery Splash. I know he uh I think he used to play Zato One, but then Zato One got nerfed to the ground and now he's playing Johnny. Let's go, Pep. Next up we got more jiggle physics. Um we got Geo. Now, once again, uh, there is a Geo player on the Jump Dash team that I have to shout out, Crescendo. Not only is he good with Giovanni, but I caught him wearing a Power After the Raptor shirt, so uh, that's a W in my book. This list is not biased, all right? Time for Anji Manji. I, I don't like that this character, it seems like a combo is gonna end, and then he just hits you in the air a couple more times, and then you get wall stuck, like just what happened right now. I don't like that. But, you know, there's someone that's really good at playing this character. And I can appreciate him more because he's a lab monster. And I feel like lab monsters get underappreciated. But, you know, he goes out here and shows his lab skills off to the public. So, let's go ooey gooey snickers. The boy danced all the way up to top rank. You may think you know who the best happy chaos player is. But you might not. I don't think you do. But they're up against Slash right now, so they have to be a good player, right? The best Happy Chaos player is... Oh, I have to say it, don't I? It's Leffen. I mean, the boy won Evo. He really uh, shows how good Happy Chaos can be, even though I, I hate that character. Oh, God, just look at it. But you know what? Leffen, uh, Leffen does well with him. I think he's switching, though, so... Good news, but I think he's switching to uh, a person I also hate, Gold Lewis. So, uh, bad news. But, congrats to Leffen. He's good at the game. He's good at Melee, too. And you guys know, I saved the best for last. The best Potemkin player. I want to say me, but uh, after doing the pot only tournament and getting one two, I, uh, I can't say that without doing a gigantic laugh. So I'm not going to say that. The best person, though, is Baba. Introducing Baba. Baba, man. He is too good with pot. Every time I fight Baba, I just lose. And you know what? He's going to take Frosty Faustings. I'm calling it right now. A boy might come at Baba, but Baba's going to pull through. I guess a, a boy is pretty good, too. He may be the ultimate Potemkin Doomer, but uh, he's really good with the character, so... I have to give him props. Oh shoot, you know what? I actually forgot Abby Seraph. Oh man, Abby Seraph. Uh, you know, you'll take the top spot. And there you have it. There's the official 2023 best people that play these characters. Um, if you want to say something else, then leave it in the comments and I will, I will not agree with you, but I will slightly agree with you in the comments to make it seem like I'm, I'm nice. Anyways, Thanks for watching, till next time.